Hello everyone, thank you all so much for stopping by the channel today and welcome back to this brand new video. Now in today's video I am going to be showing you how to do the outfit transfer glitch with components basically and create outfits with that after the latest patch on your next gen console as well as the bypass with uh, the choose character screen because I've read that some people have some issues with that so I'm going to show you in this video how to bypass that and how to successfully do this glitch. So let's get started. So first of all, you want to make your way over to a online session on the account where you want to make your outfits on. Now keep in mind that um, you have to do this from the second to the first character so that the character where you are playing on right now would be in slot number one on the character selection screen. Now you will lose all of your outfits on this character, so that means that you can only save one, which is the one that you are currently wearing. Now what you're going to do is you're going to grab the outfit that you want to keep and everything else will be removed, so simply apply that to the character of your choice. And then you want to open up the pass and manage characters. Now, once you go over to the screen, as you should notice that you will get this screen. I am doing it with a different account right here, but the process will be the same. And then you can choose between the two slots. Now, what you're going to do is you're going to click on create a new character and just simply confirm that. And then you will get this screen right here. Just simply wait until that is over. Now then you can choose a career because you will get four million dollars in GTA. So you're just going to click any of these. I just chose the executive. Then you're going to grab a business center, grab a warehouse, a vehicle and a weapon. But make sure that you stay within that four million limit. Then you can go over to summary and simply click start your career. Now you will load into a online session and then you will as well get a or you will load into the character selection screen. It doesn't matter which character you pick because we will be deleting this one afterwards. So just simply grab a character and take that into online. Now if you load into online then you will uh, as well get a screen with a tutorial. Now you do not have to do this. You can just simply open up your pause menu. From here, go over to the online tab and just go back over to manage characters. So then you should notice that you will get on the normal screen as you would normally see in GTA 5. Now after this, you want to get the other screen again. So what we're going to do is we're just going to delete that second character. And after you have deleted that, you can simply press circle and just go back over to story mode. Now in story mode, or you will um, be at the main menu if I'm correct you can just go back over to story and then to an invite only session and now you have prepared your account for the transfer glitch basically so that's the first bypass now if you load into this online session of course you are wearing the outfit that you want to keep here I'm just quickly looking through them now if you have grabbed the outfit that you want to keep you can now go back over to um, the pause tab, go to online and from here you can go back over to that manage characters option and then you will get at the old character selection screen. Now in here you're just going to create a second character, make sure that it's the opposite gender. So for the purpose of this video I'm going to be making a female outfit so that means my second character will be a male. Now create a character of your choice then you're going to take the picture and just take it into a online session now you will load into a public session so i suggest you to find a new session and then go to invite only now in this invite only session you're just going to create your component outfits i have a full playlist uploaded but I do want to say to you guys that the checkerboard components have been patched by Rockstar Games. So if you decide to make any of my outfits and if they do contain some checkerboard items, please do not copy that because your outfit won't stick. I have to change the titles and everything, but I find it really sad that they patch the checkerboard items. But just go ahead and grab your components and just save them on this character. I'm just going to be doing it with a little test outfit right here. 
Now, after you've created these, you just want to back out and open up your interaction menu and hit the easy way out. Now, after doing the easy way out, you can simply open up your pause menu. From here, go over to the online tab and then you want to go over to creator mode. Now in here you want to go over to create a race, then you want to press tutorial and then you're going to accept this alert that you're getting. Now after that you can immediately open up the pause menu, go to online and go back over to the manage character screen. And on the screen you are going to be deleting your second character where you have made your components on. So pay attention that you are not deleting your main one and make sure that you are deleting your second character with the components. Now after doing that, of course, the character will be deleted and this is where the second bypass comes. You want to hover over your second character and then you're going to go over to the profile which I have put in the pinned comments. And this user is basically online all of the time and he is standing in a free aim session. So basically you want to look up this account on your next gen console and basically join him. I am doing this on the PlayStation 5 so you can look him up and then you can join his session. Now after doing that, of course, your game will start loading and it will start joining the session. Now because he is in free aim and most of you guys are on auto aim, it will create like a little error. So make sure that you are on auto aim and not free aim or else you cannot join this player. Now if you get the alert, if you want to join the session, you simply want to accept that. But you will not join the session, you will go over to story mode. Now in story mode, you can just go back over to a invite only session. Now in this invite only session, you can go over to the closed door and then you should notice that your components have been trans over, transferred over to your character. So here I have that test outfit that I just showed you guys. So I'm going to be saving the original outfit that I wanted to keep right underneath that. So that is safe. And here is that test outfit. It's nothing special, but it's just for the purpose of this video. And that is basically how you do this outfit transfer glitch. So I'm just going to be customizing this up a little bit. Like I said, it's nothing special just for the purpose of this video. So if you have any questions, feel free to ask them down below. I hope this tutorial was helpful for you guys. And of course, I hope to see you back in the next video. Bye guys.